What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course CM Puma and wherever you may be and however you may be watching, thanks for making this video a part of your day. Now this is going up on the 3rd of November. This is a Thursday. It is late here in Houston. Folks, the Houston Astros won the World Series against the Los Angeles Dodgers. I know this is wrestling, um, but we are massive Astros fans in our house. There were screams from all directions, fireworks going off in our neighborhood. I mean, people are crying. This is intense. And, um, you know, as a city of Houston with um, Hurricane Harvey coming through and pretty much destroying uh, a good part of the city, uh, this is great for our city. And, um, you know, Houston definitely deserves it. A handful of years with losing 100 games uh, to this year winning 101 games and decisively beating the Red Sox, the Yankees, and now the Dodgers. It's um, it, it's a great, great moment for our city. So uh, congratulations to the Houston Astros. Uh, there is a, a title belt that I made. It is on Community Creations. The hashtags are Astros and World Series and the Big Puma. It's on the PS4 Community Creations. Go in there, download it. I actually only need 39 more downloads to get to the next load or the next uh, level of uploading. So, yeah. So, congratulations to the Astros. Houston loves you guys. We can't wait for you to get back from Los Angeles. We'll start this party off right. Back to the video now. We are in the monthly pay per view of September. It is Night of, Night of Champions, I believe. Clash of the Champions. Um, yeah, don't change shows. You will lose your title. And it'll go back to, apparently, Kevin Owens. Apparently, we also have a rival in Enzo Amore. So I don't know what we're actually doing here. So let's see. We'll watch your back. It's, uh, yeah, okay. We, we, you, you told us that already, Roman. So here we are on Raw. There's... Sparta over there. Joe, what luck. I was hoping to run into you tonight. Really? Why is that? Because I've grown quite tired of you, and I've decided that I'm going to do something about it. Well, that's interesting. And what is it that you're going to do? Probably take a beating at the hands of CM Puma. Easy. I'm going to kick your ass at Clash of Champions 16, provided you accept this challenge, of course. Um, We're going to fight Joe at the pay-per-view. Let's do it. All the silly talk before it, you absolutely, you're absolutely on. See you at Clash of Champions. Well, at least you're not a coward. You're just not smart either. So we're, we, we win this match. We get some uh, attribute points, which we need. And um, then we get to uh, move up a little bit in the company man timeline or the company man line. Let's see. So I talked to Sparta, and he said some things didn't load. Some... Um, some, what am I trying to say? Logos and stuff didn't load. So that, that kind of sucks um, that that's happening. But we'll stop and talk to Renee on the way back. There's Dana Brooke. Hey, girl. I remember being in your shoes. I would have one helping. Okay, it, you're just talking just to talk. Nothing helpful. We actually need to change our shirt. We've got the United States Championship on there. I don't know how I feel about that. Vince? Nope, no Vince. Gary? Webster? My man. Huge huge fan. Keep it up. You, I will do it just for you. Um, Hey, hey, excuse me. So let's change our shirt real quick because it's got the U.S. title on it. We need to, uh, we need to get that off. All right, so we changed our entrance attire, and you can see we've got our regular old mask back. Um, we kept the big um, TLC mask in our entrance, which we'll see. Let's talk to Renee. Re Renee. Let's talk to Renee real quick, see what she's got to say. Do you think the stakes are particularly high for this match? Is it do or die time? Every win is a piece of my legacy. The stakes are always high. It's definitely a crucial match. Here we go. For me, the stakes are the same as they ever were. 
I've got a legacy to plan, Renee, so every victory is an important piece of that legacy. That said, I'm not overly worried about this match. It's do or die for him, maybe. For me, it's just do. After everything you've accomplished, do you have anything that you regret? Maybe having all of my championships stripped from me. I don't regret anything. Regrets? I'm starting to regret agreeing to this interview. What kind of silly question is that? Do you know who you're talking to? Go ask the GM if he thinks I have any regrets. Everything I have ever done in this business has been absolutely perfect and to the letter. I'd never change a thing. If anyone has regrets, it's every fool who has made the stupid mistake of getting into the ring with YouTube resident Big Cat CM Puma. And All right, Renee. Well, let's go talk to Todd. Well, let's see, is Stephanie in here? Is she going to tell me to stop bothering her? No. All right, if this is a pay-per-view, then where is everybody? Especially, oh, I don't know, the GM and and whatnot. Mick, he's going to tell me he's too busy. Todd, my man, what's happening? The crowd is rowdy. Better put on a good show for them. Oh, oh I will. CM Puma versus our truth Oh, I forgot we had Maurice. All right. Okay, let's fight our truth, I guess. All right, here we go. CM Puma's got a new shirt. We had to take that United States title off. And we have Maurice as our tag team partner. Rise. Boy, that is a sweet entrance. I'm ready for the for the uh, DLC to come. So we got the H Town on the shirt with the Houston Astros World Heavyweight Championship. Look, look into you, the soul. Look into my soul. Jesus, that is a scary looking picture right there. Got that? Wait, man, that thing is awesome. Where's Maurice? There she is. All right, we're gonna skip it. Let's get on to our match here with our truth apparently. I see you over there. So Puma's back at it again. Regular old mask. Just uh I thought I thought the big TLC mask was just kind of funny. Kind of funny looking to wear all the time. I'm pretty interested to see what the Survivor series um reward is going to be. Come on Puma, what are you doing? Oh, dang, nice pullback Hurricane Rana. Up top goes CM Puma. How about we touch and an elbow drop bit. right to the All back of our truth And now Puma's telling this man to, to suck it. Here. Oh my gosh. Hey, he's a WWE superstar, which means uh, he's forearm. The very best to a second boots. But does he have elbow to chop. To beat his and Puma going in on our truth here. To be seen. Under the legs. Oh! Our truth with a big the super kick. Puma, though, right back. Nice judo flip. He's going to pick Truth up. Maurice out there. The WWE stolen. Straight up stolen the the fight to from The Miz. And go. Oh, elbow care. drop. All right, Puma. Can't let our truth get advantage, take advantage of you here. Oh, man. We were right to the right near the end. Very Big drop kick to the drop back kick. of the head by our truth And we're... Oh, Puma rolls out just in time. And a kick away from our truth How weird. I didn't know. I, were those in previous games? Because I don't think they were. Hook up Truth by the ears. Oh, no. uh. Nice. We're going to vaulting job. body the press on that. They never seem to reverse those moves when we. To do battle in the ring. Those, uh, I think it's obvious that our truth is a Diving outside For moves. They never seem to the reverse WWE them. The Universe adores this guy and gets behind him no matter who he's going up against. Oh, man. I believe. Oh, just as I say that, of course. Of course. This might be the only video today, guys. I'm. It's uh. It's 1 a.m. here in Houston. Um, after we've done a lot of hooting and hollering and 
and uh, crying and cheering and all kinds of stuff. So what an amazing display this might be the only video we get done, that one was off mainly because I am just awful. flat out just exhausted. Uh, the game was just intense. Uh-oh. Puma going right back over the top rope, and this time he gets a shoulder block, a spear from R-Truth. And R-Truth is just going to stand there, and now he comes in. Puma now trying to get to his feet, and he catches a, oh my gosh, a reverse suplex. So Samoa Joe said he was going to face us, face CM Puma, at Clash of the Champions 16. Which and he lands a nice counter. Um, but we're facing some uh, our shoot. Oh no, we still got him. Heat seeking, baby. Oh, Maurice with the chair. Maurice with the chair. Can I? Is this legal? Let me see some here. Match rules. DQ's on, so it is definitely not legal. So we're gonna put that right there. And can we? Inside the ring now. I was gonna try to look at the ref here the frequency and of this maybe move hit him. Uh. At this point, to say the least. He is a one -man and we're gonna hook up our truth by the wrist. Hurricane Rana, very nice. Commonly known as the Hurricane Rana. Great Leg drop right across the throat. Jeez He's Louise. For it. Oh, okay. The ref takes the chair up, out. He's and we, our truth, catching these feet, man. That's These it. people aren't ready for the feats. Here's a chance to win this. Come on, Come on. Truth, you can Come do on. this. A He's bam, elbow man. drop right to the groinal section going of the body. The Where are you going, our truth? Incredible. Oh, get stomped. Get stomped. I, I think I think we can end this right now. Kick. Big chop. Big strikes, chop man, again. I, I think we can rows. end this. Face this way. Or two, there you go. Wide open. Wide open spaces. Puma's climbing up to the top. Out onto the ledge. Coast to coast. Jungle to jungle. Seeing Puma hits our truth with that big kick to the face. Count it, ref. He's looking for the win. Yep. The singles match has come to an end. We get a big win at the pay-per-view. Even if it is against our truth, it's still on the main card. We get the victory right there. All right, Todd, what do you got to say? I like what you did here tonight. Let's see more of that next week. Well, Todd, very insightful. You're in the way. No, I haven't seen Vince. Heading on back to the back. Steph, are you in here now? No. She was is not in her office. So we got Roman Reigns and Nia Jax, the lady looking for Stephanie. All right. Let's get the car because it looks like we're going to be facing Samoa Joe in the next match. Here we are in the first week of October. We still got Roman Reigns back here. But we got a little Bailey over here. Got some Bailey action. Oh man, have you ever thought about changing up your appearance? Actually, it's funny you say that, Bailey. We just did. We just did. Renee Young is here again. She got them things. Let's see who else is backstage. Is that Rich Swan? This big giant goofball. All right, let's go talk to Todd. All right, Todd, my my friend, what you got for me this week? The crowd is rowdy. Better go put on a good show for them. That's what you said last week at the pay-per-view. Uh, okay. Am I not facing um, Samoa Joe? He's not even on this dang card. All right. Well, due to time constraints and me being full-on exhausted from watching that game, uh, this is going to be the end. So when we come back, we got the Venomous Pumas and Primo Cologne taking on Big Cass and Enzo and Carl Anderson, which is strange. But I guess we're not going to have our Samoa Joe match, which also, that sucks. 
So that's gonna be it. What's for, what's Todd watching? Oh, that's pretty interesting. That's gonna be it, guys. Thank you all for stopping by. Please leave a like if you enjoyed what you saw. Subscribe if you're not. You're missing some great content. Hit that subscribe button, the little bell for notifications, and I'll see you soon.